to this. And I went to singing it. Well, I sang it. I said, I'm going to meet my loving mother down by the riverside, down by the riverside, down by the riverside. I'm going to meet my loving mother down by the riverside. I ain't study wall no more. I ain't going to study wall no more. I ain't going to study wall no more. I ain't going to study I thought Nellie understood things that I had to learn. I had to go to school to learn. Isn't that beautiful? Here's an old, old Nellie May Rowe. Nellie was 78 years old and she was so light in her walking and talking. She was just gay and she, she was laughed and and didn't seem like her feet touched the ground. Nellie's yard was so famous, her drawings relate to this first masterpiece of hers, her environment. This may be a person who's outside just looking at Nellie, wondering what is she doing? That's what people wondered. People thought that Nellie just hung things haphazardly, but it's not so. Every when Nellie would talk about it, she'd use the word place a lot. She'd say, I placed an object. Nellie would never sell this, this little doll because it's little Nellie. She said it was like a real doll. I love the expression on this doll's face. Nellie said she made as many dolls as she's made drawings. She was drawing because she loved to draw, and then she found that there were people that loved her drawings, and she just loved doing the drawings. And when we had the show, she, she didn't think about it. I mean, I told her, I said, we're going to start. Before you know it, we're going to be selling works in the hundreds. I didn't really know. It never affected Nellie. When she died, she was selling works for 2000. I think that's what I really want is that uh, my pieces that I love the most, I want someday to be in a museum someday. Who knows? Nellie Mayro may be considered high art one day.